Well, hey, there's a program that's the first of its kind in the country right here at Children's Hospital. It's called Josh Cares, and as Fox 19's Corey McCall shows us, the program is there for sick kids whose parents can't be. He's very nosy. Um, he likes to see what's going on out in the hall. Um, he's very energetic, smiley. Say hi to 11-month-old Brandon. He spent most of his life at Children's Hospital. Brandon's mom, Mariah, and his dad, Brandon, can't be with him every day. They try to provide the best that they can for him, but unfortunately with the economy and the whole situation we're in right now, it's just really hard for them to be here 24-7 for him. And that's where Leah Covert comes into the picture. Leah is a Josh Cares Fellow. Josh Cares is a program created in honor of a little boy who spent some time at Children's after a tragic bicycle accident. They wanted to address the need that there were critically ill children here at the hospital who had little or no visitation from their parents. <laughs> <laughs> parents like Brandon's parents, who want to be here all day every day, but just can't. They have um, jobs that they can't leave, they have benefits that they have to go to work every day to get their benefits and they need their income. The goal is for kids like Brandon to be able to eventually go home, but while they're here, the Josh Cares fellows tell mom and dad non-medical things, things like games they played today, milestones the child has reached, things that mom and dad would know if the baby were able to be at home. Hi, Mama. They um, comfort them and hold their hand when they're afraid or feeling terrible. They go with them when they have a scary medical procedure. At any time, there are around 30 chronically or critically ill kids at Children's with a Josh Cares Fellow. Leah visits Brandon every day. She's really a surrogate parent to him and a liaison between the doctors and his parents. We are working really hard on tummy time, playing on the mat, um, sitting independently. The day Brandon gets to go home is getting closer. Soon he'll be able to see mom and dad every day. But until then, mom and dad can rest easy, knowing he's in great hands at Children's and in loving arms with Josh Cares. Corey McConnell, Fox 19 News.